Welcome to our Coding Corner. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question from one of our viewers. They want to know how to sort a list of doubles by the fractional part or mantissa of each number. For example, if we take the input list of 1.2, 2.3, 1.12, .1, and 5.1, how can we rearrange it so that the output is 5.1, 1.12, 1.2, and 2.3? Let's dive into this challenge and explore how we can achieve this in C Sharp. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video, cheers. To sort a list of doubles by their fractional part, we first need to understand how to extract the fractional part from each double. Next, we will create a custom sorting function in c -sharp. This function will compare the fractional parts of the doubles. In this code, we use the sort method on our list. The lambda function calculates the fractional part by subtracting the floor value from the original number. Finally, Let's see the output after sorting. The list will be rearranged based on the fractional parts. Let's now look at a user suggested answer. To sort a list of doubles by their mantissa in c -sharp, you can create a custom comparer. This involves implementing the iComparer interface. After defining your comparer, you can sort your list by calling the sort method with your custom comparer instance. This approach is reusable and avoids over-engineering, making it a practical solution for sorting by Mantissa. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To sort a list of doubles by their mantissa in c -sharp, you can use a simple approach. Instead of using math.truncate, you can subtract the integer part from each number. Finally, you can display the sorted list by joining the elements into a string. And that's it, guys. I hope the video has helped find you to that resolution and you are able to get through your problem. If it did, guys, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. It does help me out. And until next time, have a good one.